I just wanted it to be more like stuffy and more taste because it's a natural yogurt. It's actually a Greek, Greek yogurt with a protein uh, powder. That means I'll like eat a little protein. So I should maybe, well, I did kind of exercise today, so maybe it's good, but it's a bit late. Anyway, let's not care. Starting much here T is better if you want to start blue. Also in this game, we could cheese them maybe, level one. Olaf and the rice are stronger than they are. So we could cheese them, but I see be cheesing people. I don't like to cheese people because I don't like to be cheese myself. That's why I don't cheese that often. Will you not eat a banana on stream? I ate a banana already, my friend. Did you... Did you... Went to the toilet to grab your loop and to grab your... Uh, Hand towel? That's why you missed me eating a banana? You were, you were like, that was the highlight of the day? Or? If that was supposed to be a highlight of your day, then I'm sorry, but you missed it. You can, you can go back and check the replay, how I ate the banana. And I, and I would put sugar in the yogurt. I really like frozen yogurt. Fro frozen yogurt is my favorite ice cream. Which is not very ice cream, but just frozen yogurt. My loop stays by my bed, actually. Same. Vikus with eight months, Martin, I guess. Thank you very much. Vikus said more success, like even more successful 2020, and I hope you got some rest during Christmas and I'm saying yes I did and thank you very much I don't think they can dive rice the only thing they can do is gank mid lane, so we should be a bit careful. And I don't think they can fight. He can fight for the crab either. I don't know if it's good. I guess it's good because Ornus his Q before, so. Maybe I'm trolling by trying to dive Leona instead of trying to dive. I mean by trying to dive Soraka, not Leona. But Soraka is barrier and also I feel like Lee Sin could be on mid, but he shouldn't be around the other lane. Am I dead? He has to flash for it now, okay. I think it's worth. Maybe with a bit of lag I could even escape because of... Um, That was not good by Syndra. He should step the other way. But in some cases, I could even survive because of Nimbus Cloak. Okay, Lysim will have two kills, so Lysim will win against me. Unless I get level 6. When I get level 6, I should win against Lysim again. Now we do full clear and we just try to get 6 as soon as possible. They could try to maybe look for a dive mat, but I think Lysim probably based after getting uh, full camps and also two kills. Frost the shield. Thank you very much for 100 beats, my friend. The chill or the chili? Let's see if my assumptions were correct or not. Yeah, they were. This is here. Well, I can't really stay. Uh, no, don't do that. I can't stay because this is around and Diana could move also. I will just go far my jungle. It's okay. Happy 59, thank you very much. Well, if I'm really honest, I could have also stopped tanking the tower a bit faster. Why is he pinging so much? It's quite annoying. I 
I can just tank the Q, that's all I can do. No, well, I can't really tank that Q even. I don't think we get a kill here. I mean, I can't really help her, if I'm honest. Wait, Diana is here as well, okay. Hmm. Yeah, well, playing aggressive mid lane really pays off, doesn't it, Mr. Uh, she just killed three people. That is not good at all. So, like, I can always join when someone is low HP. Because, well, she gets extra man speed. That will be quite a complicated in the game from now on. That's really funny. I guess they are really panic flash though. Okay, now I'm 6, now I can fight, but the issue with my 6 is that Lee Sin already has um, Warrior, so I still cannot fight. And Lee Sin also has Red Smite over me. So, in this game, this matchup is very somebody as well. So, I will never be able to fight Lee Sin. Unless we go, unless we are like 2v2 maybe, with like Leona maybe I will be able to. But not by myself, ever. Oh, she fucked up on auto. I don't like I do not like my Aurelia very much in this game. Okay, top is dead, let's do Drake then. So one for one. Maybe we can get a kill bot if they don't uh, look out for Leona. Because uh Leona's going as well. I think in this game our ults are not that insane, but it's still better to get it. So they don't get it because Arnold with low cooldown, for example, sounds really OP. They do have Warrior now as well, and they will probably get cut out. So I'll try to go behind and kill Ezreal on the next wave. If Listen is here to protect Ezreal, then I will die. So I will not take the plant, I will save the plant, plant for the. So they did get the herald, like we mentioned. But their bot lane will be behind Lee Sin here. I don't know if he used um, when they were fighting or like when he killed Rise. I don't know if he used stopwatch uh, ult or not. If he has ult, he can maybe look for a kill. If he doesn't have ult, then no. Oh, they dive this lane. Genius spray marks or something. Give up tower. Without ult and without base, I'm not. Oh sh! That is not good. You know why this is not good to go in here? Because at least he might have kick now. I don't know, he doesn't have kick, apparently. That's really weird flash from missing though. Fog. Oh. 
Can farm a bit more again. I think maybe enemy raptors were up. Maybe I could steal them. I'm coming, my friend. You pretty much want this one, no? He'll try to break kill. This guy's really fast, by the way. Um, I, I wonder why he was. I guess Arden makes him fast. No, he doesn't. No, he does. Eight percent. Okay, now I'm really strong myself. Because before I would always lose to this scene because he had item advantage and red smite. Right now I think I win until he gets black cleaver. It depends, right? If I have ult, I can maybe win because I can all in him. Like my all in is really powerful. I don't think ganking all in is that good. Leona has a lot of damage on Orn because she has magic damage, but it's not that much. Like it's not a, like a damage that would kill a target. I think. I don't have seen the old yet, so not happening. And about top match, I don't know if he's supposed to win that one. Well, this guy kind of full HP, so. I think team fights should be stronger as long as we have wolves. You know, Orn, Orn has a very powerful loot as well, Soraka and all of them, but like right now, Syndra is stronger than their carries, and also Diana is not really uh, in the bot side fight. But yeah, this guy has 160 armor, so he's not going to die easy, right? We need Rise and Syndra to kill that guy. I think killing the tower is good here, and I think Lissing going top is very good as well. For like them, I mean, like Lissin is playing well, right? He can see that he cannot fight and... He just went elsewhere to make a play. I wanted to kill Soraka, I got pink to do Drake and I actually wanted to come in this brush to try to kill Soraka and she'll die right now and that would be like even better for us. But it's okay, I I'm just listening to my team. I'm doing Drake is not bad, but we could just slow it down by a bit and get a kill maybe. Why don't we just ult? Why do we hold on that guy? Why is that mountain? Mountain is not bad for me and Leona. It's also pretty good for Orn because he can stack more magic resist than we can. Or like our more magic resist. Please, 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 I'm just fine. Okay, he has Black Lever and, Ma and Mercs. So Mercs don't help him that much against me, but Black Lever does. I would say he's stronger than me right now. I think I can maybe still win all in. I, I don't know, because I don't know how much Red Smite can change. I think without Red Smite, I win. With Red Smite, I might lose. All in, obviously, Olaf, my, my, Olaf is really OP in all in, right? So if Olaf doesn't win on all in, that means, yeah. Uh, that means like someone really outscales me or I'm really behind. Oh, this is, doesn't look very good. This thing is on the way as well. I don't think I should look for a kill right now. No, I think she is just dead. Not much I can do about it. Orn is just a better champion to fight like that. Because he's tanky and he doesn't die. Orn basically won this 1v1 and the only reason why Orn had to flash is was because I was there. One more out though. 
So they used flash on Soraka. I flash on all. This is a tough. Situation to be in. I thought maybe they would TP with uh, Diana or something. Or, or maybe. I think this in this game we should really play for Drakes if we can. Because I get outscaled by Lee Sin. I think all of us are actually getting outscaled. So we really need to step up the game or at least play decently well to close it out. No, right now I'm still like not that strong without like here, for example. If I hit the axe, she's dead. How how come this guy just keeps dying to Diana? Pretty weird. Orn could be on the way. I have two damage so I can do some damage to this guy. If she wants to fight me, I can fight him. I'll do Herald now. Okay. Mm. 50 seconds to drag, so I'd like to get a drag as well. How can Rice get that scaled? I think if he dies to the one shot to Diana, he does get that. Okay, so basically, I think Olaf for sure scales bad. I think Ezreal with like 6 items is stronger than Syndra. I mean, I don't think we get outscaled hard, but they also have Orn, and I think in mid game. We should lose if they play team fights well. And also at this point, I mean, our, the rise is like dying 24 7. Like at this point, our rise is 2 7. And he's just pinging, rage pinging Syndra. I don't think we can fight for the Drake now. He used might, so that's maybe I can like look for it then. It's weird that they are not. I mean, I guess they are on a base. I feel like they should just do the Drake if they have TPs and stuff. But use listen to smite, so there's a chance he doesn't have smite because he, he used smite on the Ona in a previous fight. And smite is quite high cooldown right now, so. I, I love when people do that, there's no reason to steal it from the jungler. I get more XP. I could be a bad int. But it's like, I, I think I can always run, run Soraka down with my champion. I think... Uh, I mean, they are speed pushing well. They are doing good stuff. But we can just run it down literally every time. Oh shit. Oh shit, very shit. That's not a good fight. That's not a good fight. Still not a good fight. She's tipping somewhere. I don't think we should start chasing them. Rice will die if he starts chasing them. This Rice. Leasing has kick now, I don't fight. They could go Nash. We have TP at some point. Rice is dead. Unless it's just a bait. Looked like he was just a bait, so one for one, I think.
We have TP, so no wonder they want to chase. We should ult me in. Not very smart. I don't think we can do it. I'm just zoning Diana, I just don't know where she is, but I'm so. Oh. So uh, about uh, Rice feeding um, seven kills to Diana and us fighting against Diana after, yes, it is not helpful for Rice to die nine times in this game. And about outscaling part, yes, Diana is very hard to deal with when she's level 16, when everyone else is level 13 in the game. So, um, and she also has extra item from home. So yes, it is it is difficult game. Day Ke and Kapi, thank you guys for Twitch Prime. I don't think we uh, we win against them anymore in fights. I think Diana just wins the game now. If the, Diana just got uh, four kills and Nashor gold and like a, just a lot of gold overall, did they get Nashor? I'm sure. I'm not sure actually. But anyway, the point is that Diana is going to pretty much one shot everyone, and Rice is useless. Everyone in fight is useless except for Diana in this game. Okay, she didn't buy that much, did she actually? She bought only. She bought only until she has dead cap, maybe it's playable. And she gets dead cap, it's lost, probably. I don't think this fight is that good, honestly. And now we lost the fight, ladies and gentlemen, because we tried to engage. But oh shit, I'm trolling, I actually didn't even... I started running inside of the fight again. I think it's... we can't win, probably. I don't think it's possible. I think Diana will just carry this game. Cheer 200! Thank you very much, Flash Rockstar! I think in th this game we had to win before, not now. So, I mean, I think obviously like Leona chasing there and making like a Omega play didn't work out because it was like a really bad play, right? Like it was, it was just really troll to do that. Um, but the point is that we had our chance in team fight. Like 4v4, the game was really won. But as soon as Diana got a quadra kill, the game was really lost. And maybe our only hope is to get like a Dragon Soul. And then after a Dragon Soul, if we can maybe get the Elder Drake, maybe then we can win. But I don't see how to win against like these items on Diana. Because we cannot kill Orn, we cannot kill Lee Sin if they play well. They have Soraka, and Soraka was dying only because she was in bad position, not because we could actually kill her if she stays, you know, in the back line. So there is not a lot of ways of us. Okay, I think we just do it now. Honestly. Let's go. Let's flip it. I love flipping the game. So we got the dra dragon shield. So Diana is chasing us, she's fucking up. Diana was still not in this fight, that's why we are still not losing it super hard. But now we do. She's so fast as well. Oh my god, this champion is so broken. But I think I uh, rise out. Never mind. Rise doesn't have the damage yet to deal with all neither. He did like a lot of rotations, but he doesn't have the damage to deal with all. He can heal Ezreal if he can get to Ezreal. Which he, you know, can't. 
Okay, this is going to be quite interesting. <laughs> Wait, how did listen do damage to me, by the way? Wait, what, what does it say that listen do damage to me? I think the game is so bugged that, that I mean, like Diana shouldn't exist, so when it does so much damage, it just assumes that the, someone helped her, even though she just killed me alone. I'm just saying I have 120 magic reses and my Hex Drinker didn't even pop, she just fucking killed me without popping my Hex Drinker somehow. I, I don't know how she killed me without popping my Hex Drinker, I have no clue. But she just killed me. I know in some games, you hope that you get... Um okay, we killed her! And now what? Okay, now are we actually winning this? Apparently we are. Okay, well we lost uh, two in hips, soon three in hips. But we apparently wanna fight. Bog. Apparently we wanna fight. <laughs> I don't know why, because she didn't even use stop her, she just kinda ran it down. Leona just did a full combo on her and her instead of running she just took it on her chest. By the way, this is the second game that I will lose with Dragon Soul. I lost uh, one game with Blazing Dragon Soul because we were not grouping. I mean, this game it's more of a of a us being behind thing, over actually us not grouping and stuff. But my point is that this is the second game I will lose with a Dragon Soul. How is she so? Oh, I guess Magi, Magi on. Level 18 to level 15, 14, 15, 15, 12. I know, I, I feel like if solo lane gets really ahead now, and he like plays one fight well, and he gets like a lot of kills in that one fight, the game is just lost. That's what happened kind of. Like one fight, she got four kills, the game is just out of control. I mean, I guess it was a nice and into Nars, so maybe it's just nobody, but like I just don't get how is she level. This is uh, 18. I have to wait for rice. I'm so scared. I mean, I'm, I'm not. I'm not the scared one. There's there's a lot of more people that should be scared compared to me. It's going to be quite interesting. He's dead again. <laughs> but this time Soraka is just healing them for full HP! <laughs> you see that 1k, 1K gold pop? I loved it. I love the one, one, 1k gold pop. But yeah. Too many deaths my friends. Too many deaths from Rice. Losing to Ezreal Soraka. Well, I did not lose to Ezreal Soraka. I lost to Diana, okay? That's not Ezreal Soraka game at all. Ezreal Soraka were like 0 10 at some point. But they were still winning. Can you guess why? Because of a 44,000 damage champion in their team. And I have no clue who has it. Why was uh, no previous ones? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> Grievous Wounds could help us if we get it like a Morello or Executioner. 
But keep in mind, we didn't have AD carry, so we couldn't get Executioner unless I or Irelia get it, but it's not very useful. And also, um, yeah, well, they, like we had to itemize to not die one shot to Diana, right? So yeah, but it was, it was, you know, a fun game to play, just very difficult to deal with Diana. Classic gameplay? I might. You play the Japanese or Korean girls more? Um, I know. I have Timo Antrik in my team. Wait, isn't it... Hmm. Should I ban Akali or should I open it? Hmm. Let's ban. I always ban Akali. Let's play a Kazik game and let's ban Alicin. I, I um did I play Kazik today yet? I did, right? I'm pretty sure I did play Kazik's. Is there a champion I, I, I didn't play that I would like to play? Let me see. I played Rek'Sai. Hmm. I don't know actually. I don't have a champion that I really want to play right now. I feel like uh, maybe Kha'Zix. If Kane is good in this game, I will play Assassin Kane. I have a feeling uh, uh, like I would like to play Assassin Kane, but only if it's good in this game. I don't think Kindra is that strong in this meta. Echo, not that strong either. Why to Manakali? Just powerful. Hard to gank, a lot of damage, very hard to deal with. In team fights. Oh, 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 oh,